Welcome back to Resident Evil Village. Uh, when we left off, I left you guys at a little bit of a cliffhanger, but we're going to jump right back into it, put the flask in the thingy, and see what happens. All right, let's see. Flask, flask, flask. Here we go. Giant's Chalice. Ooh, this probably goes to the other one. Well, I guess we're off to see the wizard. Alright. I'm probably going to get attacked on my way, aren't I? It's usually how it goes. Oh no. What's going on? I agree, Ethan. What is going on? You know what? I should probably switch to my shotgun. I don't know what's going to jump out at me. Did I hear something? Man, that castle is pretty. Alright. You know what? I just realized the sensitivity in this is horrible. Can I increase that? A little better. All right, here we go. I'm excited to see what happens. All right. Are we gonna get the baby? Do we build it like a uh, GoBot or whatever? GoTron, what was it called? What was that, that, that robot that was made of a bunch of other robots? I don't remember. Voltron, I think that's what it was called. Oh, we're going down. Oh, great. I don't like this. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh, no. I don't know where the door is going to be. This is creepy. Just keep an eye out. Here we go. Oh, man. It? You mean she? Just get your ass across the bridge. Look at those mountains. Oh man, that's really cool. I don't know about you guys, but I love mountains. I actually, uh, well, I shouldn't. I don't want to dox myself. Never mind. <laughs> uh, we don't need to save yet. He wants me to go across the bridge. That means something's going to happen on the bridge. Uh, here we go. Nope, guess ah, not. Ethan Winters. Welcome. Thank you. I appreciate I the welcome. Make it past Donner Moreau, but I suppose you survived worse back in America. Hmm? I like you. I'd like to speak to you about Rose and Miranda. Oh, there you oh, are. Come on in. Don't worry. It's not a trap. Look, if you're telling the truth, I will planning. definitely talk to you. Not gonna tell me? It's definitely not a trap. Just come on in. Everything will be fine. Mm hmm. Oh, great. Tall grass. So I gotta walk through the tall grass to get there. I know what lurks in tall grass. I've played, uh. What's that game where you, uh. <laughs> where you catch things in the grass? Digimon, right? Lots of tanks around here. Try my hardest not to correlate that to uh, certain things. All right. Thank you for the gate. Welcome. How did you know I was here? Are there more cameras? Maybe that's one on top of the water. Ooh, it's dark in here. I like, I like, sometimes I like exploring these places a little slowly because it, uh, it immerses me a little more. Because in real life, I wouldn't just run in. 
Okay, that goes downstairs, so let's hold off on that one. Let's see what's in this one first. Oh, it's been locked from the other side. Wonder who did it. It's very dark, very dark. Oh man, it's a little creepy in here. I want to see behind the curtain. Don't no, don't shoot him yet. He wanna to talk to me. Let me guess. You're through with me. Take me out like the others. And then he gets to go and save Rose, right? I'm healing my daughter. Look, y y you got this all wrong. Send him to Shut your fucking hole! Sorry about that. Take a seat. Listen, Ethan, you're being played. What are you talking about? You think this is a game? I said sit! Don't yell at me. Lady, supersized bitch. Ugly ass psycho doll. An MRNA freak. Don't you get it? It's a test to see if you're strong enough to be a part of Miranda's family. I don't want to be a part of Miranda's family. Neither did I, but here we are. And I'm next in line, right? Kill me, move up the chain. Well, fuck that! I don't give a damn about your personal issues. I just want to fix my daughter. <laughs> so do I. You have any idea how powerful that kid is? Even Miranda's scared of him. Last time, you freak! I swear to God! We got something downstairs. You and me, Ethan. Together, we can go save Rose, and then we can use her to grind Miranda into pieces. My daughter is not a weapon. Fuck you! <laughs> Last chance. You don't want to find out what's in that hole. I'll take my chances. You're beautiful. I'm great. Oh, God. It's Fan Man. Oh no, it's my biggest fan! Run, 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 run. Oh god. Oh, crap. Oh my gosh. I probably shouldn't have taken a break before playing. I'm, uh... Like the controls, I don't have them memorized this well. Oh no, I recognize this. What was that? There's something alive down here. Three PO, come in. Do you copy? Come in, 3PO. They're dying, R2. Right. Good thing I got my tetanus shot. 
Wait, how did a how did a car, how did cars get in here? Well, I guess the roof opens up. Oh well, there's a crane. I guess it's perfectly reasonable. Metal scrap. I will take your metal scrap. Rusted scrap. Good thing I already made that joke. All right. Ladder. Let's climb the ladder. Well, I hear things. But I don't see them yet. Want to make sure they're not going to sneak up on me. Oh god, who are you guys? They're playing VR. Oh my god, I knew it was a simulation. Imagine when video games, imagine when the, the NPC AI becomes so advanced that the NPCs think that they exist. Oh god, it's terrifying. You're basically a god in their world. Right. Gotta watch out for my biggest fan They're coming after me. I shouldn't have doxed myself earlier. Because, you know, there's not tons of mountains in the world. This place is messed up. I've got to get upstairs. Oh, wow. Well, this is cool. Are they making people? Hmm. Interesting. Oh, how did you get in here, Mr. Man? Elevator. Tell me about it. How's it going? All right, don't tell me. Feel free to peruse. The Duke's Please Kitchen. Take a look at my new stock. Yes, I will take a look at your stock. I can now offer an expanded weapon modification service. You can. I see. Well, you know, my 1911 can always use more power. And you know what? The shotgun, I don't really care about the reload speed, but you know what? I'm not hurting for cash, so... Extra baggage! One of my most popular items. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure everyone buys that. You know what? I probably could use that. I'm what? skilled at all sorts of weapons. I don't want to sell those. Oh yeah, he's like eyeball palace right there. I think I messed up with the silver ring. I feel like I missed something. I think that's good. Let's go ahead and sell. Uh -huh. Did I sell my gun there? Nope, not enough yet. That's fine. We'll come back later and we'll Ooh, we'll get it. We don't need it right now. All right, my friend. I look forward to seeing the fruits of your exploration. Well, thank you, my friend. That's right, we're on episode 9. Alright, I guess we're taking the elevator down, but first I want to come over here and make sure I didn't miss this map. Oh gosh. Ooh, the door opens. This gives me um, Aliens vibes. It's one of my favorite franchises. One of them. Especially the original. I know most people like Aliens over Alien. I actually prefer Alien, the first one. Um, specifically because I feel like the um, the tension and the buildup was really good. It's, it, it's a slower movie for some people, which I completely understand. Not everyone has a... Uh, Everyone's attention span's a little different, so that's all I mean. 
All right, so I can't open this yet, and I honestly don't think I want to, considering what I'm hearing. Oh, it looks easy to break. Well. Hello, boyos. You're in a simulation. You need to get out. Everything you see is not real. Check on my back. Don't surprise me with a jump scare. There's not enough power to press the button. Oh, I got it. Okay. This reminds me of that part in Biohazard where you had to jump down to fight, uh, what's his face? In the, the little arena area where you had the chainsaw. Let me know down below if you guys want me to play that um, in VR. And I will, I, I may replay it. And maybe I'll do it as a bonus video, just add it on. It won't, it won't, maybe it won't take up my normal videos. If you guys really want to. Um. Because I love that one. But, and in VR, I, actually, it might be a little embarrassing if once I get to the B part. I have a really, really bad phobia of hornets, wasps, and bees, and I had to get help doing that part. Could have had a heart attack. <laughs> Sorry. This room is off limits to civilians. Money! Give me all your money. Thank you for the money. Now please. Why do I feel like a uh, fanboy is about to show up? What would I use here? I don't think I have anything. A crank? No. It's probably something else. I'll have to come back. There's a lot of stuff I'm going to be putting in here. Huh. And who is this? I used to always hang up my own x-rays. Uh, don't know why. But I, whenever I'd get x-rays done, which I've had to have a lot done in my life, um, surprised I'm not irradiated. Um, anyway, I uh, I would always ask for a copy, which you usually can do, and, uh, and I would just hang them up at home. It's kind of cool. At least I thought it was cool as a kid. I don't have them anymore. I have no idea what happened to them. So, someone out there has my x-rays. It's like, Vladimir, it's already in the medical system, so of course people already have it. Yeah, 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 it's true. You know what? I really don't want to waste my shotgun ammo on you guys anymore. Just, I have a feeling there's going to be a lot more of you. That's right. Reloading! There's someone in there. Oh no. This looks like an enemy. I don't want to approach that yet. I feel like whatever it is is going to attack me. <laughs> Let's explore the other area first. I think there was another door. Yeah. There's, it's going to say there's not enough power, right? Yeah. Got some gun powder. Gun powder. Rusted scrap. Oh man, you're gonna be a pain. Look at this arm. He's got a freaking auger. Did he do this too? Well, hopefully that will prevent him from attacking me. I doubt it though. I bet you he's scripted to come alive and murderize 
What's in the box? Ooh, I needed these. Please don't come alive. I asked you very nicely. I'm sorry, my friend, but I just saw your weak spot. Crystal mechanical heart. Ooh, that's cool. Isn't there like a song about mechanical heart or something? I can't think of one off the top. Oh man, I am low on ammo. I really should not have been using my shotgun that much. Um, can we make some more bullets? Let's see. I need more rusted crap. I mean scrap. All right, we're definitely gonna use the Colt then for the meantime. <laughs> Nothing to see here. I'm oh, making a mold. Here comes the molten metal. I would love to work in metalgy and uh, and smelting. That'd be a lot of fun. Some blacksmith and stuff. Seems I feel like that would be a really useful skill to have, um, especially if the apocalypse ever happens. All right. Relief of a horse. Okay. Quit horsing around. You've already made that joke. You're in a simulation. Good, you're finally awake. What is that? Oh, it's pistons. I thought it was someone's face, like... Moving around like a freaking uh, big daddy down there. What? I need a horse key? I don't have a horse key. Quit horsing around. Oh my god, I need a lock pick, right? Uneasy to pick lock. Yes, yes, yes. That's why I have... Oh my gosh. You know, the game's not as intuitive as it could be not not trashing on it just saying oh just magnum ammo that's fine i wonder if i'm supposed to shoot those balls i don't know if i want to waste my ammo on it but Ah, you do. Missed. Found it. <sighs> Ammo. I look out. VR people, I have bullets. There's no reality you can stop me. Virtual or otherwise. It sounds like they're very close. They are. Are they going to get crushed? No, they're just going to keep wandering around, I guess. Hmm. Oh, hello, my friend. Wake up. Nothing you see is real. It 
has become my mission to wake up these zombies. Take off your headsets. Wake up. You're in a video game. I shall take your rusted scrap and I shall make some bullets. I don't have enough. Let's break the box. Ooh, we got some money. There's definitely more of them. I could shoot this thing, but I kind of am hoping it'll take out some of them so I can save some ammunition. Come on! You know what? We're just gonna sh we're just gonna have to do it. Oh, this is gonna be hard. Oh man, it's gotta be, there's gotta be an easier way. <laughs> ah, excuse me. Okay, so I need to wait for a moment where it slows down, which would be right here. Oh, it changes. Okay, that was dumb. Why did I do that? I was just hoping. All right. Oh man. <sighs> that looked like it hit it. And then Vlad ran out of all of his ammunition, and it was a very sad day. Let's come over here. Got it. Oh my lord, I used all of my ammo. That is a shame. I have no one to blame but myself. Come on, zombie. I'm not going to waste my ammo on you. Make your way over. You will be fine, I promise. Oh, you're not going to make your way over? You're scared? Alright. Yes, come this way. Keep trying. Hooray, he's not alive anymore. Rusted scrap. Good, good, good. Let's go ahead and make some shotgun ammo. Good, good, good. Okay. So this, I'm not sure how we're going to deal with. Uh, am I going to have to shoot all of them? I am. That sucks. Patience. There we go. And I have one bullet left? No, 11. Good, 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 good. Oh no, can I not stop this one? Oh no, I can. I just gotta. Not sure what happened there. Did a circle flip you around? No. Wait. It does. Well, that would have been nice to know. It's like, Vlad, they told you earlier, you just weren't paying attention. Probably. Very likely. <gasps> Rusted scrap. Gate. Open the sesame. Let's 
it's locked from the other side. How surprising. What was that? That sounded like Jason. Oh, crap. There's guys all over the walls. Chicka -chicka. All right, so are they going to all come alive once we get to the other side? Oh, they're all the auger guys. Well, that's terrifying. What happens if they come alive? Am I going to have to just run from them? or? Well, that's not suspicious at all. Explosive rounds. Backup generator. Okay. Oh, I have a... Well, aw. I was hoping I could use my crank. Seems like this factory is not in very good condition. I don't know how it's churning out all these guys if it's if the generator's not working and uh, most of the doors are locked on the other side. Seems kind of counterproductive to uh, getting stuff done. All right. It's a cabinet. This is where we find like a new weapon, right? Nope, just a mine. Why don't you mind your own thing? Right. I can't go in here because there needs to be power. We need to turn the power on! Oh, great. Phew! Phew! Hello? Is anybody in here? Don't mind me, I'm just looking for... Rusted metal. My car broke down down the ways. Wondering if I could use your phone. Mechanical soldier sold at. Version 1. Fully grown male corpse used. Removed hot and implanted Kaido. Muscle stimulation via electric shock was success success successful. Brain dead, so no high cognitive ability. Only moves by destructive instincts and then stops. Version 1.01 .01. Attached headgear to the cranium. Electrodes confirm stable brainwaves. Experiment 1, take and fight. Was dismantled and eaten within three minutes. Issues with destructive and murderous capabilities. Version 1.1. Replaced lower part of arm with drill. Not enough output for effective movement. Need live bodies, perhaps. Version 1.15. 1.15. Implanted Kaido reactor to the chest. Great. Output greatly increased. I'm sli slightly dyslexic. Experiment 2. Lichen fight. Destroyed three lichens in one minute. Good results, but issues with reactor durability may stop functioning if the reactor is destroyed. The reactor must be destroyed! Cog mold. Hooray, I got more cogs. I'm just a cog in a machine. Oh no. This is where they're gonna come alive. I don't. I do not want to go that way. Forget that. I'll go the long way. I'm not stupid. I know how these games work. I'm gonna go that way, and they're all. And some of them are gonna come alive. Shit. God. Oh God. Oh God. I hope there's not one behind me. You know, I tried to bypass it by going the other way. Didn't work. Crap. I just heard another one. Oh man. 
I th really thought all of them were coming alive. I was like, oh god, I'm in trouble. I mean, one more will come alive probably once this mold is done. Hurry up. I like how with the mold, is like the thing's like immediately ready. Like, I don't have to really wait for uh, it to actually uh, cool off. But Vlad, they just sprayed it with cooling stuff. Really? <laughs> he just picks it up off that, freshly melted. He's like, all right, my hands can hold this. All right, where's the next one? Come on, I know you're coming. It's almost like... Um, Prometheus or something, or H.R. Uh, Geiger related. It's kind of cool. I, I love H.R. Um, Geiger stuff. It's really cool. It's, um, you know what? Let's throw a... Oh, sh oh man, I don't want to waste that. What a shame. Alright, who woke up? That was a pretty loud noise. Nope. You guys are light sleepers. I can't believe you wasted a grenade launcher on that. Yeah, yeah, I know. I can't believe either. Yeah, here we are. Mechanical part cylinder. Hmm. There we go. <laughs> oh no, oh no. They're gonna wake up. Oh, Ethan. Such a disappointment. I thought we could join forces against that bitch, Miranda. Truly. Please don't be another one next to me. She took me. You got to be her children. She locked us away in the village. Decades of being forced to serve her. Serve her in what way? Can you even understand that humiliation? Well, I can understand humiliation, but you aren't really telling me what she did. I'm not like my siblings. I want nothing more than to be free of that bitch. So I need power. I need enough power to destroy her. Well, I did just turn on the power, so find your way to pack a punch and upgrade your telekinesis. Are the fruits of my power? The strong will destroy the weak. That's the way of the world. You should have never refused me, Ethan. What a freak. Just come back around the corner. I don't want you to jump scare me. Okay, hopefully he saw me there. You know what? We have not really used these yet. So... Maybe it's time. Hopefully that was enough to lure him. And then he comes from behind me somehow. Come on, friend. Don't tell me I wasted my mind. Man. The tension. <gasps> Come on. There's no way you didn't hear that.
You know what? I don't want to blow myself up. He growled, so I'm hoping that means he heard me. Or saw me. Come on, my friend. Apparently he doesn't have ears, because he didn't, didn't hear any of the bullets. Are you not going to come? Well, this feels like a waste of my time. Where are you, friend? Yes, come to me, my friend. It's a little closer. He knows. You know what? There's a much better way to do this. <gasps> ah! That should solve the problem. Now we just have to wait. I hear him. Did that do it? No, he's still alive. Great. He's angry. Hooray. One shot. And then I step in there, it's like, there were actually three of them in here. You just didn't realize. Gunpowder. Money. Money, 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 money. Let's see. Flashbang. I guess that might be useful. Sniper rifle ammo. Don't really use the snipers though. Alright, so should we go up here or up here? I think. I think I'm gonna go up here. Run! The dead end, Vladimir. What are you thinking? I must shoot him in the heart. He's protecting his heart. He's like, I'm saving it for marriage. Okay, there we go. We got him. And we are out of bullets. What a shame. Oh, okay, so it's just a loop. Good to know, good to know. Oh man, this is a lot of them. Don't worry, we got a handy dandy knife. Pew. Don't worry, I didn't forget about you guys down here. Hello? Is anybody... Anybody call for a plumber? Electrician, perhaps? Oh, 
Oh, you guys. Well, you know what? Run, run, run. Merry Christmas. Oh. Wake up! You're in assimilation. You will be assimilated! Very tense. I, li I like how claustrophobic it feels. Not that I like claustrophobia, but it uh, it definitely makes it more tense. That was the best thing about Biohazard is that house. It it, it was pretty big, but it felt so small. Um, oh man, especially in VR. When you're in VR, you just you feel like you're you're cla you have no way to fight, and uh, it's claustrophobic, and you don't have anywhere to hide, at least not really. It's a really good game. Oh, yours is in the back. Run, run. Come to me. Good. Thank. So happy I have those mines. Yay! I will take it. I will take it and run with it. Stabby, stabby. Let's not press that. Oh, I'm back here. Was there a safe point near here? I feel like there was, right? Was it back this way? Um, you know what? Let's check our map. It is. Oh, wait, or is it? No, it's back this way. And I got ahead. Oh, wait, no, it's not. It is this way. Okay, good. Let's go save real quick um, because I have a bad feeling about what's to come. And I want to sell those hearts and buy the... Uh, I want to buy that thing that I wanted to buy that I don't remember. All right. Oh, good. I was just thinking of ways to pass the time. Oh well, you have me now. All right. So what was it I was gonna buy? It was. Oh yeah, the ma the Magnum ammo. This is all. It or a uh, capacity magazine. All right. So let's go ahead and sell this. And as much as I like the hearts, we don't need them. A large mechanical heart. Do I really need the crystal hammer? No, I don't. And by it I will. It's like by that logic, you don't need those other crystal torsos either. You are right. I do not You'll need be them. Slaughtering things in droves. Till next we meet. Yes, till next time, my friend. Hello, I'm back. I did say till next time. Alright. Now we will go across that bridge. Okay. Open the door. Thank you. Alright, it's button pressing time. Oh, 
don't trust it, I don't trust it, I don't trust it. Do you guys remember that part in the first uh, Resident Evil game when they have like the the tyrant or whatever, and uh, you're in that like lab area and he's coming after you and you have all those different. It's basically like a just a small room you got to run around and avoid it. That's what this kind of reminds me of. Is that two of them? Just one. No, I need back up more. Good, good. Well, you try. You do get points for trying, my friend. I'm really worried there's going to be two of them in here. Oh, I think I hear one. terrifying <laughs> it's like these things aren't scary but it it's it's scary being in here with how uh, claustrophobic <laughs> you again? oh crap all right come on come on let me out let me out Back out here. Okay. Oh man, I was not expecting that right there. Pulls a lever. Oh, okay. Welcome, welcome. You're sure to find something new. Are you sure? Because I was just here. Shall I choose Do you something? already have something new? Let's see. Let's see if he's lying to me. Looks like he's lying to me. You know what, my friend? I will never trust you again. I'm skilled at all sorts of weapons modifications, and will do them for a small fee. These hands are more dexterous than one might think. Um, okay. I'll, I'll take your word for it. All right. We will continue this in the next episode. Um, this is fun. Um, I I feel like this this one's not as scary as Biohazard. That that the part with the dollhouse um, was really creepy, but it was just mainly because of how uh, quiet it was. Like the tension really was building um, very intensely. Um, I loved that part. Uh, but yeah, um, regardless of it not being as scary, it's still a lot of fun. So I'm enjoying it. Um, I'm looking forward to playing it in a moment, and I will see you guys in the next video.